are you a vegetarian? No. No. Are you? Preach. No. Are you a vegetarian? No. No. I mean, I, I try to be sometimes, but it's hard. Um. Mostly, I, like I said, I'm a flexitarian, which is is basically like I idealize being a raw vegan and gaining my superpowers from that sort of lifestyle. No, I'm not. No, I'm not. No. How do you feel about vegetarians? I feel like most of them are just like hippies or just, I don't know. Well, honestly, the only people that I would like that are vegetarians are the ones that don't eat any product from animals that are like mistreated in factories and stuff. But other than that, like, you're a pussy, bro. <laughs> um, not too good with them. They missing out the good meat. The chicken, oh. the pork chop, the leg bones, pork chops. They missing out. They're cool. Cool? More power to them. I wish I had that willpower to do either one for a long period of time. Um. That's kind of a strange general question. Um, what do you mean, how do I feel about them? Like, do I find some of them a little bit oppressive with the way that they like push their views onto other people? Occasionally. But I more so adore the fact that they are tapping into a resource that's more limitless. Um, whatever. You don't care? Nope. I don't hate them, but I don't understand why you would want to not eat like this delicious chicken McNuggets. <laughs> okay. I think it's okay, but I think everybody deserves to eat meat once in a while. Do you think eating steak is a manly thing? I think, yeah, but at the same time, I've seen a lot of guys that can't even finish a steak. No, it's a womanly thing too. Because she's crazy. Yes. Why? Because men eat steak. What about women? Women eat steak too. <laughs> um, if you want to, it's up to you. No. I think that they try to promote it as a manly thing, but I don't necessarily think it's a manly thing. So would you say it's a woman's thing? No, I'd, I'd say it's a, if you're not, if you eat meat, anyone can eat it. No, I don't. <laughs> yeah, I would say so. Why not? Why? Makes you stronger. Good protein. Women can't be strong. You don't eat steak. I'm saying, is do you think eating steak is a manly thing? Oh, I see. Uh, I mean, it is, but I guess if you're saying like that, then no, women can be strong then. <laughs> yes. Why? Because it's like a big portion, and usually men like devour it. You know. So. Why do you think Americans want to be thin? Uh, because of how everything is advertised nowadays, that they make it seem like, you know, to be thin and really skinny is healthy when it's not. Because so they won't have to have no kind of health problem like heart disease, diabetes, high blood pressure, and then they won't be healthy. That's just, that's just the way the, uh, what's the word? Um, I don't know. Um, because people, I guess we've all been programmed to think that thinner people are more attractive. Be thin? Probably because of what Hollywood markets to them as acceptable societal parameters. Because that's the new trend, like everyone wants to be skinny. And that's like the, that's a view that's sexy. Because uh, you get around better, uh, just better to be fit, you live longer because of society and media and everything else. Why is it so hard for us to stay thin? Hormone grown products. Because too much good food cooking out here in California. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> All kind of good tasty food, spaghetti, fried That's chicken, true. yeah, <laughs> taco. Because too much of this. <laughs> because it's cheaper to eat unhealthy. Because we gorge on meat and fat and sugars and salts and fake things that don't come from the earth. Gluten. We're, we're addicted to uh, false foods. We think our pharmacies are places where you get pills when our pharmacies are the places where you get food. Your farmer, like farmer's markets, if people bought their food at farmer's markets, the world would change. Because of all the fast food around us like this, but... 
if you and people don't exercise, so what's gonna happen? 